All right, guys, so yesterday I had to cut that vlog short just because I had a horrible migraine for literally two days, and I think it was just basically due to me being pregnant and all the hormones that are happening because I never get migraines. But I didn't want to cheat you guys from a really cool thing because today I am going to visit my doctor and I'm going to get an update on our baby. And guess who came? The homie tip! Not the tia. The tia. The cutie tia, tia. tia potato. <laughs> What's a potato? Potato, I don't know. We oh. just call each other's potatoes because oh, it's cute. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, we turned it to so potato. I, know. I get to see the bird. I know, you know what Bart said? Huh. He goes, he goes, sneaky ass Tiff. She just wanted a cuz so she could see the gender of the baby. I'm like, she's not like that. And I'm like, but that is fucking smart. <laughs> is that why you came? No, but I was thinking about it. I was like, oh man, maybe like the ultrasound tech or like the doctor might like that slip up the gender, so I'm like, I wonder if they're going to tell him ahead of time to say anything. No, we're not that smart. <laughs> Sorry. So how was the appointment? So, baby's developing to meet it for the first time. You freaking sneaky snake, now you know what the gender is. It was, it was kind of like right in her face too, before the lady even said it, when she did the ultrasound, she was like, oh my god. And then yeah. the lady said it, she was like, yeah. You have to keep it a secret, okay, I Tiff? I won't even tell Casey. I was, awesome. I was telling her, I'm like, at this point, I don't even care, because she was like, the, the reaction I really care about, I care about your parents, my parents, and then just Tiff. So not that I don't care about everyone else, but I just feel like everyone else sees it like, oh, it's a baby. You yeah. Know, like, they're just like, oh, cool, new life. But they don't have, like, a bigger attachment to it. <laughs> but it was cute, because I'm not. The lady was saying that usually around 20 weeks, the baby is usually around like 12 to like 13 ounces. Yeah. <laughs> but our baby is 15 with a bigger head and a big belly. <laughs> Reminds me of someone I know. I was pretty big. Yeah? Yeah, but the big head does not mean No. Yeah, uh, that's so huge. You mean the muscles? No. It's you see the biceps on that guy? The biceps on that guy is crazy. I don't know, man. Freaking big head. Well, at least everything is developing normally. How do you feel? It feels awesome. I got to saw all of his fingers. He kept throwing up the peace sign the whole time. <laughs> that was super cuny. Yeah, super cuny. Yeah, I'm just glad everything is working properly and like all my biology classes paid off. Paid off because I knew what she was talking about. She's like, oh, the sacrum, oh, that's tailbone. And then uh, she was looking for the four chambers in the heart. I'm like, oh, I know what that is. And then she was looking for the. Yeah, all those things. I'm oh cool. Well, I'm glad you two were on the same page because I was just like words. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm excited. Can't wait to hold the baby in my arms. Yeah. I can't wait. So exciting. So, um, my mom called me and she's always very like oh, self aware of stuff. She never wants to call past like nine because she's like oh they're busy they're tired like let me just let them run away. But then at this time it was like eleven at night. And then um, she, she texts me, she's like, hey, are you busy? Are you in a meeting? Can you call me? I'm thinking like, oh shit, like, like, that, like something's wrong. So I'm like, call her. I'm like, hey, mom. She's like, hey. And I was like, what's up? Is everything all right? She goes, yeah. So I'm watching Guardians of the Galaxy right now. She's like, what if you name your baby Star-Lord? What? And my mom started cracking up. And I'm like. Are you serious? She just can't stop laughing. She's like, Star Lord Quan. And then I'm like, you're just as bad as Bart. I'm like, right now, Joe's Tories is winning. I'm like, this name, no, you can't name him. She's like, come on, you gotta be more yeah, open-minded. I'm right like, now. you're crazy. She's so yeah. funny. I would never expect her to see Me neither. Ever. We'll Ever. It was really cool. Okay. I would have been like, Mom, are you drunk or something? What's <laughs> happening? <laughs> No, it just made me happy that she was happy. So I didn't, I didn't want to burst her bubble. Yeah, I was laughing with her because she was cracking up. Like it was like the funniest thing she heard in 2017. <laughs> yeah, she was laughing. So yeah. How come like, everyone keeps assuming it's a boy? Well, I don't know because we haven't told them. And she had a dream. So she had a dream that we had a boy. That's. And it's just easier to say like, oh, his, his his doctor appointment, his whatever. It's harder to say she. I think because you want. I think because you want a boy too. 
No, but usually that's the case though. When, when people don't want to say the gender, they just refer to them as boy. Mm -hmm. It's just easier to say he or him yeah. versus it's or her and she's. With Mexican moms, when they have a dream, like, that's it. <laughs> Whatever they saw, that's what's happening. Even though, like, the ultrasound would say otherwise, be like, no, 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 they're probably wrong. I had the dream. <laughs> well, your mom said we're having a monkey. She does. <laughs> she, calls, she called it Mighty Mouse. She's like, what about Mighty Mouse? I'm like, mom, just stop. You can't name it. She had a dream about a little monkey boy, she says. <laughs> with a lot of hair. <laughs> That's definitely coming from your side then. My side? The hair? Hell yeah. I thought you had a lot of hair. Look at my arm. Come on. Yeah, look at my arm. You shave it, you cheater. <laughs> let, let me see your pubic first. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 You have some too. What are you talking about? That's true. I'm pretty bushy. Yep, you got A plus. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. A plus. Okay. And you also have what we call the Asian finding. What is that? Uh, uh, echogenic foci inside of the heart. What is okay. that? Okay. Basically a bright spot inside the heart, okay? And that happens usually because there's a muscle inside the heart that we pick up. 5% of, you know, people will have that in their ultrasound findings. Not a big deal. Okay. Is and it a good like, thing or a bad thing? It's just a this? finding. Oh, it's just so a finding? There's, it, there's no good or bad associated with it. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, when we have a negative MIPG screen, that's your maternal 21, okay, that tells us everything is normal. Okay. Okay, so if everything is normal, that means these findings mean absolutely nothing. Oh, cool. If you had not had that NIPT screen done, we mm -hmm. probably would suggest getting it done so that you know that everything is good. Oh, okay. Okay. But wait, you said this was common in Asian people? Very common. Oh, so it comes from you. Nuh uh. <laughs> I would see it in non Asian people too. It's a sparkle in the heart? Is that yes. what you said? Oh, okay. And basically, it's an echogenic focus. So remember, ultrasound is looking for brightness, right? All oh, right. So it's, it's showing back a little bit brighter inside the heart, and usually it's a muscle. Mm. Mm. Okay, so it's a structural thing, but it's a normal structural Just thing. Asians oh. are stars. We're just born stars. <laughs> <laughs> okay, excellent. And now you're halfway through the pregnancy. Yeah. Baby bump is going to double in size this coming month. Oh. Oh, this coming month? This month. It'll, boop, it'll all of a sudden be there. Okay. Wowzers. So before baby bump gets there, yeah, okay, you have homework. Okay, so this is my normal homework that I give everybody. So at 20 homework. weeks, normal homework is to go stroller shopping. Oh, okay. Ooh. Okay, it's fun stuff. I don't think it's hard homework. <laughs> okay. Sounds like but fun. But you want to do it now because later on in the pregnancy, you're going to make him do all the heavy work. Oh, and you're yeah, going to end up with happening. a stroller that you don't like. Um, <laughs> Let's do it later on in the pregnancy. True, that's true. He's gonna get some tactical thing with yep. like army print, flat Crowley. black, Crowley. 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 all Crowley. of green. Do it now. Okay. okay. Twenty inch rims. I was like, but you know what? <laughs> it's okay if you do the army stuff. You can get a nice it's diaper bag that way. Yeah, yeah. Mm, okay. <laughs> but you know, because all those bags have many pockets. They do, and yeah. they're very functional. Yeah. So you might as well get your your man diaper bag now. <laughs> okay. It's very tactical. Practical. Yeah. Practical. Okay. Because, you know, for women, we just have a big purse. Yeah. And I was like, that could be a diaper bag. Yeah. You know, it's like, it just needs to hold a diaper. Yeah. Okay. It's like diaper bag and a wipe and a zip-up baggie. You're all set. Okay. So you don't really need to have a diaper bag. You okay. Have a purse. Cool. Okay. Merses are not so popular, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so diaper Exactly. <laughs> okay. So aside from that, other things to consider would be hospital registration, taking coursework. Okay, mm -hmm. what's the hospital registration? What is that? So that's actually a piece of paper you send in with all your demographic information over to the hospital, and then they'll send you a note back within a couple of months saying, yeah, we got it. Uh, what do, where do I find this? What do I do? That was in your brown goodie bag. Did you uh -huh. look in there? We just <laughs> moved, so um, I did not look in that. Okay, okay, but look in the bag. <laughs> okay, I'll look in the bag, okay. so everything's in there. A lot of stuff is in there. Okay. Your prescription for your breast pump is in there. Okay. Okay, so you also want to find out from your insurance company how to get your breast pump. Okay. Okay, because they all want it somewhat different. Okay, got it. Okay, got it. excellent. Any other questions? Um, no. I mean, everything's been pretty normal. Like everything you guys have told me, it like aligns. So, yeah, I don't have any questions. I don't know if I'm like an unfit mother at this point, but I don't Not have any all. questions. Not at all. Because well, I would say, yes. most of the times the questions um, mm -hmm. come up when you're starting to your classes. Oh, okay. Because people ask the oddest things, and you're like, oh, I didn't think to ask that. Oh, okay. Okay. And you can't really be as comprehensive as a book during these brief visits. So yeah. So the classes actually cover a lot of ground, and they actually give you an opportunity to think of particular questions to ask that are oh. much more appropriate and specific for yourself. 
us. Because some people might ask, well, can I have half a dozen people in the room? And you're like, oh, no, this is me, me, my husband. We don't have to ask that question. Yeah. Okay. So, you know, that's where, again, you know, the questions come up, but they're pertaining to the nuances that you expect for your delivery. Right. Um, I don't know if you'll help me with this or if I just have to wait for Dr. Mitri, but I would like, so she's getting married in Paris in oh, July. Mm -hmm. And I'm due in September, early September. Oh, so um, I would like to attend, but I don't know. Beginning of July? End of July. Yeah. Because yeah. you know what? You know, you're due at the, in September, but it's really more like August. Um, so you would be like 32 weeks at that time. So that's... Well, so 32 weeks isn't bad. 36 weeks is not so good because mm -hmm. you're not going to feel comfortable. So, as a, it's up to you, okay? You could go as long as there's no complications, you know, that are raising the pregnancy. Um, so this is, the, this is your new era. You are now entering this phase of buy refundable. Mm -hmm. So you're not putting money down that you can't get back. Yeah. Okay, I would play that one by year. Okay. Okay, I don't have a crystal ball to predict whether or not you're gonna have, you know, issues that right. you know, require you to be around here. International travel usually is kind of frowned upon. If you're going to do that, I would break it up into two legs. I wouldn't necessarily do a direct, because that direct is 12 hours, I think. Mm -hmm. Is it 12 hours? Or 11. Yeah, it's close. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, that's a long time to sit. Yeah. Okay, I would do, I would break it up into two segments. Okay. So here to the East Coast, East Coast, and then over. Okay. That's, that's good stuff to think about. Okay, so I guess um, if I were to, then I just, you're just saying book now, and then we'll see how I develop, and then Exactly. Okay. okay. So basically, I'm not saying no. Right. <laughs> okay. okay. But how exciting and fun for you. Yeah. Okay. Do you live there or just want to? No. You just want to stay there. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> but you already have your place picked? Yeah. Back home now. And I just done did my nails. And Papa over there, he's working hard. Um, or hardly working. I'm finalizing an email. Fine. And then I see little legs over there. Who do they belong to? If you guessed for Briggy. Yeah, Briggy. Yeah, Briggy. Yeah, Briggy. Oh, look at how cute that is. Then you guessed right. Get it, Fawn. Get it, Fawn. Whatever's in your butthole, get it, Fawn. Get whatever's in your butthole, Fawn. Get it, Fawn. Ew. Fawn, you, Fawn, your butthole. Don't look at me and lick your butthole. Fawn, don't look at me and lick your butthole. Fawn. You dirty, dirty girl. All right. If I know Meatloaf, I know he's over. Hey. Hi, boy. Hi, my sad little puppy. Hi, my sad little puppy. What are you doing, sad little puppy? What are you doing, sad little puppy? <laughs> sad little puppy. Oh, you sad little gentleman. Oh, you sassy boy. <laughs> are you serious, dude? You're going to rub yourself? Are you kidding right now? You Don't rub yourself on me, Briggy. Hey, boy. You're so Stop. Stop it. You're so sassy. Oh, you're not sassy anymore. Am I bugging you? Am I bugging you, boy? Don't leave, boy. Don't leave. Don't leave. Good boy. Good boy with those cutie butts. Oh, cutie butts. <laughs> cutie, cutie paw. Give me your paw. <laughs> <laughs> Give me your paw. Good boy. Give me your paw. He put his face over his paw. Give me your paw. <laughs> Fine. All right. Well, home now, but not for long because I'm really hungry and I want to get food. Oh, I'm so hungry. You know, like, I've been really liking that Gio's pregnant because <laughs> she's been feeding for Chinese food, which I always love, and finally I'm able to get it. 
Look at these dumplings. Does that look fucking Oh bomb? yeah, I was trying to eyeball that. It's like hand wrapped. You wanna get dumplings together? I'm down. What about this looks pretty good too? Whoops. Was that beef noodle soup? Yup. Which number is that? 52? 52. Yeah, look how many different beef noodle soups they have. I know, it looks crazy. Okay, so maybe that. Oh, do you like this? Have you had this before? I have, but I don't like it. What if I take out all the cilantro? No? Not in the mood? No, beef not wrap, really. Beef roll? Not really, but you could try it. Maybe I'll like it better now. What, what is Shalom this? This looks good. What is that? that? 61. Uh... Dan Dan noodles with mince pork. What the fuck <laughs> is a Dan Dan noodle? You want some Dan Dan noodles, homie? Dan 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 Dan, dan noodles. It's like a mince meat. You want Dan Dan noodles or not? What's 77? That looks bad. Look, what is this? 75, 77? It's an empanada. 77 is steamed mini pork buns. That's the English translation. What's the 75? Damn, they got all kinds of fried Make rice. Make an egg omelet. Damn. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff here. What, do you know what you're going to get? No, I haven't looked at the menu. What do you mean? You've been looking at it. Not like really looking at it. I've just been like being a fat person. You just like Dan that Dan looks good. Or not? No. Hold on. So I do want this for sure. Disa. What's this? Stir fried shredded chicken. Mm, I don't know. Do you want dajamian? This looks good too. Like dajamian, right? I do. Number 60 is dajamian. Are we going to share? Uh, maybe. I'm kind of, I feel I'm kind of like sick though. I kind of want something So you don't want to share. You want to be <laughs> selfish. Fine, I'll share with you. No, you can be selfish. No, I'm not. Fine. Alright, so what are we getting? Uh, let's get a beef noodle soup. Okay. Dajamian. Okay. I don't even know why I'm saying it Korean style. Zha jiao mian and uh, sui jiao. Okay, and beef noodle. You said that already. Yeah. What about for you? Noodle mian, zha jiao mian, and sui jiao. How about you? How? Oh. Uh, what do you want? What are you eating? What's the noodle mian? Can you split it? Fine, we'll share it. <laughs> Is there enough food? You want a large bowl? Uh, how? How? Pretty good. <laughs> it was a lucky guess. Right? Yeah. Can I get a. Uh, what's this one? Like the steamed pork dumpling? The steamed dumpling. Uh, which one? You were speaking Mandarin, just speak it. Uh, okay, can I get a. Uh, this is a bai tai, bai tai, bai tai zhu wo, bai tai zhu wo. Really? Ah, this is what? This is only zhu. Oh, only zhu ro. Uh, yeah, they got a ton of dumplings though. I don't know. Pick the pork one. You want pork leek, one. bok choy, celery? You or know pork? which one I like. You know. <laughs> I do. Yeah. Uh, let me see. You have a bai tai zhu ro, right? Oh, okay. I'll tell you, uh, I'll tell you, uh, Xiao Long Bao. Okay. And then, uh, the Bosan Yo Rou Mian. Where are the drinks? And then, I'll tell you, uh, Zha Jia Mian. Oh, the drinks are right here. Oh, okay. okay, don't get something that's gonna keep you up all night. Like what? A tea that I can't have? No, I'm just kidding. Oh, you got I'll smoothies. Just have, I'll just have water for now and then I'll order one later. Okay. All right, so my night has come to an end and I am ready for bed. Papa Bear's over there, but ass naked. <laughs> it's like you were waiting for me. Are you peeing? No way. Oh, it's like you were waiting for me. I heard you go Papa Bear was there butt ass naked and I was like, what? Yeah. I was just saying how I'm ready to go to bed. Pupper keeps sneezing. I don't know if it's allergies or if he's getting sick. I hope I'm not getting sick. I hate getting sick. I feel like I am getting sick. Sorry. Feel better. Okay, well, I think this is good night from the most Asianist robe I own. Good night. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.